into the forest, other Pokemon might be able to help us. Listen, it all started when my trainer's Raticate died. He blamed me for his death. Oh my god, he's trying to kill you? No, 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 you don't listen. My trainer blamed me for his death. Wait, I am not a curse. I am not a curse. Look, I don't care what these things are. I'm getting you away from them. I don't want them to hurt you. You cowards! You brought suffering on this poor defenseless creature. Oh no, the oh, 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 oh. So, please, get up. Please, wake up. Loneliness. Curse you, evil creatures. Curse you. Come on, Sylvan. We need to move to Pelotown. Don't abandon, abandon them. Evil. What? No. No. No, no. I won't leave him. I won't leave him. Lonely. Did you die? If you did, you deserved it. No! I didn't mean that. No, no, no. Wait a rest. Guillotine. Guillotine? <laughs> what do you mean? No. This is it. This is it, Sohyan. Goodbye, Sohyan. No! No! Please! It's not fair. Blindness. You are youthful and innocent. It's not fair. It's not very sick creatures. It's not. You better hide. Yeah, because when I find you, I'll kill you. You wanna hear me? You're dead. Please. This can't be real. The cover. And he's still inside. He's just waiting for me. Loneliness. You're the best man I ever had. You're always so youthful and innocent. You are not a curse. You are a blessing. That's the animation of the creepypasta. My final thoughts on the Pokemon creepypasta? Extremely well done. I'm gonna sum up why that is in five words. Good Samaritan with a twist. Now for those who, per chances are you know what the Good Samaritan is, but ch for those of you who don't know, it's about this guy, it's about this guy who's a Jew, who that was left that was robbed by thieves and left on a road a priest and another person passed by him ignoring him when the good when a Samaritan goes by and helps them helps the Jew man that's a Jew now the Samaritans hate the Jews and every but then but then the man normally Samaritans would hate the Jews but the, the guy that's Jewish that thanks the Samaritan the Samaritans happy that he gets better that's the story that Jesus told. Well, what do I mean by with a twist? Well, in the Good Samaritan story that Jesus told, it was a happy ending. In this story, it ended bad for the Pokemon. When that was being victimized and being rejected. Someone finally accepts him, yet he's yet it's yet he is taken away from the person that accepts him. And this is a pretty strong story. Very sad indeed. The vocab is just great. Great the uh, blood and gore. It's a little kind of violent, but not that bad. 
that bad the language well you just gotta be careful I decide not to do the language at all because well L I would I'm I'm not, I don't never mind but the language in it was kind of little vulgarish and I can see why though it's a very strong story and it makes perfect sense this is one of the few times curse words I've seen would actually fit well in the story okay. the only other time I've seen that would be in written literature book and literature like Sherlock Holmes Harry Potter all that good stuff but anyways but anyways the story was very sad and I had a really good time making this now I know this feels a little corny and a little, well, some people might say cringy, although I don't think it's cringy. Just a little corny and little. It's supposed, it's so somewhat supposed to be that because I want to make you feel like, oh my god, this is so uh, heartwarming. And then just watch as it all snaps away. Now for a lot of reasons, it's very difficult for me to replicate that. I was using Gary's Mod Windows Movie Maker. And enough about the ramp. Well... Yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed this animation, and I'll catch you later. Here, make sure to like, and subscribe, and comment. If you would have done something different with the story, what would you have done? Oh, quick note, that extra scene in the movie like, that Evie's dream, and some other stuff, this is my interpretation of the story, and I modified it so that it's not an exact copy. I didn't want to have a carbon copy of a story. I made it more original, in my opinion. And the nuclear bomb scene is hinting that I'm going to be doing something else. Now, I know a sequel is coming up, but I want to change it. Change the story up. So, I'll see you later, and, and be sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you later. Oh, and by the way, Halloween's coming up, so that means happy Halloween to all of you, those. And for all those who don't celebrate Halloween, well, still have a good time, or whatever you celebrate then, still have a good time. Alright, that's all for today, and that's it. Gosh dang it, what do you want me to do?